We begin a new liturgical year, as well as our preparation for Christmas, on the first Sunday of Advent. This four-week preparation period can be described with one word, Advent. The Latin word Adventus means presence, arrival, or coming. When Christians began to celebrate the birthday of Christ, they used this meaningful word, Adventus, to signify the time of preparation for Christmas. That means this new king is entering our city of earth to visit his citizens. In a spiritual sense, this king is going to be born in the hearts and minds of all those who are willing to receive him. This is a time of great joy, as heaven is to embrace the earth and the Son of God is to be born among us. Adventus is also a time of the expectation of good things to come, since Jesus brings us hope. Our present life becomes more meaningful when we are people of hope. In the particular situation of the present world, we are all expecting a life without the fear of the coronavirus. This means that we all live with hope that this pandemic will be disappearing soon. Let us try to understand all these expectations with the coming of Christ during this Christmas season. Then it will be an occasion of rejoicing that Jesus is born into our lives also. Today's Gospel reading speaks also the second coming of Christ. It means that He does not get tired of visiting us continuously. There are several occasions in our daily lives we need to be vigilant to experience His presence in the events and in the people around us. This Advent is not only of external preparation but also internal. As we decorate the streets and houses with lights, we need to decorate our hearts and minds with goodness. When we see so much darkness in different parts of the world, we, the children of God, should be a beacon of light. Jesus will be visiting our town during the season, and He wants to enjoy the goodness of light in each one of us. During the month of December, the days are short, with the sun disappearing early. Some people may feel sad and even depressed when the light is gone. But each one of us is filled with so much goodness. There is so much light hidden inside us. We should be willing to show goodness to all those who are around us. A little light in us may be able to brighten the life of a person who is in darkness. When we reflect in our lives the love, compassion and goodness of Jesus through our words and deeds, we are actually removing the darkness from this world. Let us all try to be a reflection of the light of Christ during the season of Advent. Amen.